It's a very intimate instrument uh, in that uh, both hands are touching the strings. Literally, your right hand is uh, caressing the string, so to speak. There are so many angles for which the right hand finger and nail can touch the string to create different sounds that, uh, that makes the guitar an extremely intimate and sensitive instrument. Dre Segovia then selected him to attend his master classes. Well, it was a great privilege and honor to be able to work with uh, literally the greatest guitarist that has ever lived. Uh, however, it was also a very terrifying experience. And when he would look through his very thick glasses and uh, signal you to play next, uh, your heart kind of skipped a beat. And uh, he, was, he was a very, uh, very much of a taskmaster and uh, a perfectionist. achieved international success in his early 20s. Then he sat back and, like a number of musical prodigies who are pushed too far too fast, began to wonder what it was all about. I was playing about 90 concerts a year uh, through, throughout my 20s and um, at about the time I reached 30, I had pretty much burned out from playing so much and I took about a three and a half year sabbatical where I didn't uh, perform at all uh, nor did I make any recordings. The purpose of that retirement was to recharge his batteries. For parkening, that meant the state of Montana and fly fishing. I had a great love uh, in my childhood for the out of doors, and in particular, fly fishing for trout. Uh, my parents used to take me to a ranch in the high Sierras of Northern California, and there I learned the uh, art of fly fishing. Do you find that there is a similarity between fly fishing and making music? Uh, I can relate it uh, to the extent that um, it, it takes discipline and it takes perseverance and uh, it's a wonderful sport and in terms of of that i could relate it to music during this period parkening also discovered his spiritual faith a discovery that brought renewed strength and significance to his life through that period of time i guess that i became a christian and my priorities changed and i decided that i wanted to start playing the guitar again, but for a different purpose. As a matter of fact, Bach was a great inspiration to me when he said the aim and final reason of all music is none else but the glory of God. So I decided to go back uh, touring again and performing and recording, but uh, this time to try and glorify the Lord with the music.